I just got this box in from the daily look. So I don't really have time lately to go shopping. So I decided to try one of those personal shopper kind of things. It's where they pick out clothes for you and hope that you like it. And it's a big box. So let's get right on in and see what's inside. Okay, so the hashtag is elevate your style and it's nicely packaged. Let's see if I can bring you guys over here. It's a little wrinkled, but now oh, they do have a cute little ribbon. The only thing that I don't like so far with not the box, but just the service itself is the fact that I did not like half of the things that were presented to me and you're only allowed to deny like three products. It's something super stupid. So whatever, I guess. All right. So enclose your personal stylist note and return instructions. So let's see what my stylist said to me. Hello, Rebecca. Welcome to Daily Look. I hope this message finds you well. Smiley face. I'm thrilled to inform you that you're specially curated fashion box is ready for preview and will soon be on its way. Each piece has been thoughtfully selected to reflect your unique style and preferences. I've included a mix of versatile staples and statement pieces that I believe will seamlessly integrate into your wardrobe and elevate your look for any occasion. In this box, you'll find a variety of outfits perfect for both casual and more elevated settings that are easy to mix and match and accessorize. I paid special attention to your feedback and style profile, ensuring that each item aligns with your tastes and needs. As you try on each piece, I encourage you to experiment with different combinations and have fun creating new looks. I'm confident you'll find many new favorites among the selections. Should you have any questions about the styling, fit, or coordinating pieces, please don't hesitate to reach out. I'm here to help and would love to hear your feedback on how everything works for you. Thank you for trusting me with your fashion needs. I look forward to seeing how you rock these new styles. Jessica. And it says, get 50% off one item when you keep three and 50% off two items when you keep five. All right. So I'm gonna pop back and show you from afar what everything looks like. Okay, so this is the first piece. It has a hood. It feels pretty warm. I kind of have something similar in my closet already, but let's just, let's see how this looks. I don't know if I'm really feeling this <laughs> because it doesn't really snow or rain here. So, I mean, the pockets are cool, but it's just, I don't know. I'm not a fan, that's for sure. This is definitely going back. Up next is somewhat of a style that I have in my closet, but it's a different color. So I'm gonna pop this on and let's see what she looks like. So this is supposed to be like one of those tunics. I think it's like more like, they say boat necky, but like, I don't know. It always goes off to one side for me, but I actually like this fit. I think it's very flattering on me. It's um, it's a pretty color too. So I really like this shirt. This is one of those tunic style shirts and it I think looks good on me. The color is definitely, it's really pretty. Let me see if you guys can see that. It's like a heathered blue. So I'm definitely liking this fit so far. So I think I might actually keep this depending on the price. <laughs> Up next is this weird looking thing, which is not my style at all. So I'm not even going to try this on because first off, like why do we have drawstrings right here? Like what? I don't know. This is just, I wish it told me what price it is, but it's just, this is ugly. Like, am I joining the military? Is that what's going on here? No. All right. Up next we have a crop top sweater because you know big boobs and a belly is really what i want <laughs> this is just what size is this yeah this is like what the hell all right well i guess i'll try it on and we'll see my belly okay what in the absolute like <laughs> really in what setting would you think that i would want a sweater that like where's my belly button my belly button is right here no 
No, ma'am, I'm 37. All right, up next is this beautiful piece right here. It looks really crop toppy, so let's try it on and see. Again, this is another one of those tunics where it's got like the flowy arms, which is nice, but I don't know if I go for that darker color, should I stick with this? I don't know, and I don't know if I like, I don't know. It's just, it's pretty, but I feel like if I have one of these styles, I don't really need another one, right? Like it's just, it doesn't seem practical for me for a wardrobe. So now here is a mock turtleneck, which I don't really wear these. These literally look like my mom, like, like I'm trying to be a mom. No, thank you. Oh dear God. And it's freaking dirty. Are you kidding me? Like, right there. It's dirty. Again, a freaking crop top. Actually, it's like dirty all around the collar. Like, this is gross. A crop top denim jacket. No! <laughs> like. Okay, now this, I did say that I wanted this scent because I think it looks cute. I just don't know how it's gonna fit on my big old booty. So let's give it a try. Um, this skirt is really cute. However, um, my butt is right here. Like, this is my butt cheek. Like, I don't know. I think it's cute. Maybe if I got a bigger size, I don't really know. Um, <laughs> I mean, it's kind of cute with this, but I feel very self-conscious with my butt. So I did get some jeans, which I'm excited to try. So this pair and then this pair. So let's try these on. All right, so these jeans fit really comfortably. Um, I'd have to go look in the mirror and see how I feel about them. Um, they're kind of straight leg, which really isn't my favorite. Um, I kind of like a more maybe boot cut, maybe a skinny pants so these are probably going back because they're probably way overpriced jeans that I could find a target for cheap so I actually do like these jeans I think they look good I'm gonna go check them out in the mirror here in a second um they do have a cute little fray they are boot cut so yeah I'm liking it but <laughs> if this is literally all I get out of this or maybe this too ugh, like this box was a complete mess Especially when I gave feedback on like why I wanted to switch items around. Sometimes I think that these box subscription personal stylist stuff, sometimes I think it's just, it's baloney where they give you an amazing first box and then all the boxes after that are just lit and then you pay $20 wasted to get it shipped to you. And I think this was 40, 40 so. All right, so I'm gonna come back with the pricing and my final thoughts. So I will see you guys back in a minute. All right, I am back. I have changed clothes because I was in my work clothes. So it looks like they did not send me any price list with it. So I have to go to the text message they sent me. So let's go over the prices together. Guys, this is flipping hilarious. This is flipping hilarious. This is $98. This dirty freaking $98. That going back. This is $88. $88 for this going back. This is $88. I liked it too. Going back. Actually, correction, that was $90. This this cozy sweater that is a crop top, this is $88. This ugly flipping utility, this is what it's called. It's a crop utility jacket. First off, why would I want a crop jacket? A jacket is supposed to keep me nice and warm, right? Uh, $85. Um, this mock turtleneck ugly looking thing, what is that? $70. This thing, $105. The cuffed boyfriend jeans, $90. The mini skirt that my butt was hanging out of, even though it's very cute, $68. And the jeans I actually liked that I wanted to keep, $128. I'm sorry, but there is no jean out here that I would ever pay that much for. Like, unless the jeans are gonna get me a husband, pay me money, get me some kind of an acting gig. I don't know, but the, no pants out there are worth this much unless you're gonna make me look like a hot, you know what, 
mm -mm. so for me this is a no dog like uh, -uh. i'm canceling the subscription this is stupid i i don't know maybe i should give it one more time let me see if she redeems herself i'll come back and do another review i'm just like for some of these boxes, they need to, in my opinion, hire people that are of that age group, hire those people to do the age appropriate stuff. I don't need some 20 year old picking out things for my 37 year old big boobied and belly butt. Like I'm good. So I hope you guys enjoyed this review. If you liked it, give me a thumbs up. It helps the algorithm and helps me stay relevant and I appreciate it. So if you guys want to be part of the dollhouse, be sure to subscribe to my channel and hit that bell icon so you get notified each and every time I upload a video. And you know what, leave a comment and let me know which items do you think I should have kept. Do you think this price point was worth it? Let me know guys. I'll see you next time. Enough. Okay, move. I know you want to see me change, but come on. Box 